Hi everybody, it's Kelly. Welcome to K-Dove Love. This is my show on truth and love. I am a clairvoyant and metaphysical minister and this is my show on truth and love. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, let me give you my email. kdovelovexxx at gmail.com It is also my tweet. It is also my Facebook page. Thanks to you guys so much for coming. And liking my Facebook page. Welcome to all my new subscribers. I love you so much. Uh, thank you for subscribing on YouTube. Um, it means the world to me. Thank you. Um, I just love uh, whenever I post my shows, I see I have new subscribers. It makes me so happy. Thank you so much. Um, okay, so let's get on with the show. Um, oh, P.S. If you're looking at this bra going, we've seen that bra before. No, you actually haven't. My friend Rhonda made me a bunch of bras and I, it was another color. It probably looks a lot like this, but something about it was different because <laughs> I only have about 90 of them. <laughs> so it was different because I really, I don't ever wear the same thing on the show yet. I only have about 200 more outfits to go and then I will have to get more outfits but I have some people that give me outfits so thank you so much thank you um okay moving on uh today's show <laughs> I know because I'm sick I'm a sick pig um today's show is called Papa and uh we are talking about it's kind of a two-part show because um I'll wear another bra from Rhonda in it um similar um, but uh, it's called Papa, and uh, we're nearing, it's, I know, you can't tell, but it's winter, and we're nearing the holiday season, and uh, so we're going to talk about gifts and giving, and along with that is another show I'm going to do, so I'll have Papa 1 and Papa 2. Papa. I know. Who, do, who wants to be my big daddy? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Hi, daddy. Okay, I know, I know. But um, whenever I think about gifts, I think about my daddy, my papa, because there was only one thing I didn't get, which was a baby goat. I wanted this goat, and he's like, you're not getting a goat. Your mom says no on the goat. I got a dock. My, I know, I was spoiled as spoiled can be. Trust me, I didn't get the goat. But, well, Daddy, I want that goat. <laughs> my birthday, I ran in the backyard. It was my birthday morning. My dad woke me up, and I'm all, hi, Daddy. And I ran in the backyard looking for the goat. And he's all, there's no, I ran past a bicycle. I ran the bicycle outside. I'm like looking for a goat. He's all, you, you're not going to find a goat. <clears throat> Stamping my foot. Yeah, I know. Oh, you couldn't believe that story? How weird. Yeah, and we were living at the beach at the time, which is even better. Have a goat, baby goat there. My mom will. We're not getting a goat. Okay. So anyway, enough with the goat. Anyway, here's a concept. Part one of a two-part series. Here's a concept that... I want you to think about and it is nothing I thought of it is something I read and I went whoa it really changed my thought process on it and it is we're talking about gifts and you know we're always praying 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 meditating asking 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 and we're constantly giving gifts and the process, the thought process is don't love all the gifts. Simply love the giver. Whoa. I'm like, whoa. Whoa. And, of course, you could do that on this plane with humans, of course. I, I, I don't even care about the stuff my dad gave me. I care about when we went to the tide pools together or when he made me laugh. 
<laughs> when you tell me really messed up stories or, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, we're the same personality. So I understand that. But of course, we're speaking of higher source and simply love the giver. Whoa. It really just opened my third eye. Like, I just went, whoa. I had to sit there. It was such a big, you know, adjustment of thoughts. And what a lovely, amazing, beautiful thought process. And simply love the giver. Don't love the gift. Because we have so many gifts, and we don't recognize them. Ever, 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 ever. Because we, as humans, will take advantage, granted, not advantage, granted, of the fact that all our parts move. Our eyes work. Our ears work. We can talk. Anything. I have food in my belly. I can breathe. I can think, um, I can hear, I, barely, but I can hear, <laughs> you know, so we have to, uh, I'm constantly, constantly trying to get people to recognize all the gifts they get from higher source. I think we take, we just overlook them, overlook them, so we need to look at the gifts that we are given, but more than that, look at the giver. Oh! Don't love the gifts, love the giver. Wow. I love the giver. Love the giver. Love, 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 love. Thank you. So, part one, I will come be coming at you later this week with part two. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. And these are n n not original thoughts by any means. Yeah. Please know that. Thank you. Not today for not original thoughts. That was a thought I got from reading a spiritual book. Thanks so much for coming. KWLoveXXX at gmail.com. I love you guys. Bye.